everyone. <laughs> Welcome to the Gallifrey Gals Kit Wibbly Wobbly. We have somehow magically made it to the last episode of this season of Doctor Who, which is nuts because we watched it all while in quarantine. All only one episode wasn't in quarantine. Oh my gosh, you're the right. The very first, first episode. Like, I still feel like I just got back from my trip to England. Yep. And it's July yep, yep. now. It's just it's July. It's so it's strange. fucking July. That, you know what? I think we're making it work. I'm proud of us. I think we're making it work. And I think it's also been, it's, it's been a fun way to go about the reactions. Yeah. Like, it's got its pros and cons. Just the same thing yeah. as, like, us sitting together has its pros and cons, mm-hmm. you know? Um. Yeah. I feel like especially when we're sitting together, you can like the two of us like really have to be careful as the fan because like we're both yeah, very good at picking up on your... body language yeah. and we are really good at sensing like energy. And when we're right next mm-hmm. to each other, that's like a little bit harder. This has been a little bit easier. I feel like I can look more at the camera and be like, yeah, I've noticed I, we notice each other a little less. I have mm-hmm. to like actively Just enough. kind of check in. Yeah. Just enough. Um, yeah, not that we're ignoring each other. It's just, it is. It's like, you're right. It's like just the right amount that like, I don't catch as much. Not that I, not, not that, that you really were giving before. anything away before, yeah. because I am always very like in tune to like, I am engrossed in yeah. the show. I'm not looking at you very often, but unless I'm the fan, unless we're watching Star Trek, then I look at you more because I want to see how you're reacting. Because I want to see. <laughs> but, um, so here yeah. we are, oh. the last episode of this season. What? Yeah, I mean, that's Paula. Oh, that's Katrina. Right. Hey, isn't this a cool shirt? You can get your own cool Gallifrey Gals shirt at our you merch could. store. Go to our website, gallifreygals.com. There's some sweet My, stuff My uh, bucket hat is up there right now. I don't feel like I've wearing it I've got to moment. get that really cool Star Trek mug, by the way. Yes. Here we are. We've made it. Um, we are on... The final episode of the season. Series. Um, I, it, I, there's like, it's, it's especially harder with the two-parters because there's really not much I can give you right yeah. now. There's not much I can say. We can just touch base on where you were feeling before. Um, yeah. I there's mean, a lot happening right now. There's a lot of shit coming to an end. I just don't believe any of it. Okay. I don't believe any of it's real. I'm not even convinced the whole season's been real. Yeah. Uh, the Which doctor is, kind of is trapped in a box. About. River is exploding. It is intense. Uh, Amy's dead at the hands of fake Rory. You know, like, what's happening? Who knows? Who could say? Stephen Moffat, you might be a dick. Just I'm might be. trying to decide. <laughs> so. uh, well. You know, I think that's it. Oh, just 1,894 years later. Guess the universe didn't go away if existence is happening. Well, it seemed as everything else. Oh, I guess modern day is this is the, maybe this is the moment. Because if they were back in 107 AD or whatever. Mm-hmm. Time, you yeah, guess what? It's wibbly wobbly. We don't have to understand Dear it. Santa, <gasps> thank you for the dolls and pencils and the fish. It's, it's Amy. It's Easter now, so I hope I didn't wake you. But honest, it is an emergency. This is the first episode again. There's a crack in my wall. It's not because at night there's voices. This is the first episode again. So please, please, could you send someone to fix it? Um, or a doctor. Ish. Oh, did I spy a fez through that well, door? Was there a fez? Pandorica. Come along, pond. How? But she's a... <gasps> Daleks. Whoa. He's been in there for that long. That's horrible. Who took the drink from her? Penguins. Sorry. 
She's so cute. She still has her coat on. And her wellies. Could you imagine? Okay, kid. This is where it gets complicated. What? That's her! What? The what? <laughs> could do with a ridiculous miracle about this. <laughs> She's not dead. Well, she is dead, but it's not the end of the world. Well, it is the end of the world. Actually, it's the end of the universe. Oh, no, hang on. But you're not in the Pandorica. Yes, I am. Well, I'm not now, but I was back then. Well, time is so strange. He has Jack's watch. From my point of view, time travel, you can't keep it straight in your head. It's easy to open from the outside. Just point and press. Go, Rory, go. Temporal energy, same screwdriver at different points in its own time stream, which means it was me who gave it to you. Me from the yeah, future. Handy. I've got a few. <laughs> I've got a future, that's nice. <gasps> All right. <clears throat> who are you? I'm fine. I'm supposed to rest. Got to rest, the doctor says. What doctor? He's in here. I have to message in my head like I'm an answer phone. She's going to be in that box for 2,000 years. Yeah, but we're taking the shortcut. River's vortex manipulator. Rubbish way to time travel. But the universe is tiny now, we'll be fine. So hang on, the future's still there then. Our world. A version of it, not quite the one you know. <sighs> Rory. According to legend, wherever the Pandorica was taken throughout its long history, the Centurion would be there. Oh, boy. Exterminate! What's that? Exterminate! Oh, it came alive. Uh. Oh. Ah, oh. oh, two of you. Complicated. Exterminate! My blood systems are spraying. Come along, Paul. Come on. Do you think? <gasps> it's Rory! Still protecting it! Ah, oh, it's beautiful. Gosh. Amy. The mop. Uh, that's how you looked all those years ago when you gave me the Sonic. Ah, well. <laughs> Time is so weird. Wait. Now I don't have the Sonic. I just gave it to Rory two thousand years ago. <laughs> Oh my gosh, ridiculous. <laughs> nope. How? How do you know? Come here. There you go, drink up. What is that? How are you doing that? Vortex manipulator, cheap and nasty time travel. Very bad for you. I'm trying to give it up. <laughs> Very bad for you. And say he's gonna give himself a nosebleed. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. Uh oh. He said, River Song killed me. Oh, you can do loads in 12 minutes. It's like a mint by a sledge, have a fast bath. Have a Come fast on, bath. We can't leave you here dead. Oh, good. Are you in charge now? So tell me, what are we going to do about Amelia? Where'd she go? Amelia! There is no Amelia. From now on, there never was. History is still what? collapsing. Like I said, I'm looking for an exploding TARDIS. So that's the sun, is it? Is it? Well, here's the noise that sun is making right now. Wow. That's my TARDIS burning up. That's what's been keeping the Earth warm. Interesting. Doctor, there's something else. Of course, the emergency protocols. The TARDIS is sealed off the control room and put her into a time Ugh. saver. She is right at the heart of the explosion. I'm sorry, my love. I'm sorry, my love. She's just reliving this moment over and over, over and over and again. Over How awful. And over. I'm sorry, my love. Like stuck in the last loop of trying to. <laughs> How did he? I'm home. And what sort of time do you call this? Yeah. Amy. 
me. Convenient. And the plastics and I told you awesome. none of them were really mm. dead. I dated an Estine duplicate once. Swappable head. Do keep uh -oh. things fresh. Right then, I have questions. But number one is this. What in the name of sanity have you got <laughs> in your head? <laughs> <laughs> It was raised from time and then it came back. How? You sent the light from the Pandora kit. It's not a light, it's a restoration field, but never yeah. mind. Call it a light. Because it's completely impossible. Ah, no, you see, it's not. It's almost completely impossible. One spark is all we need. For what? Big Bang 2. Now listen. <gasps> That's no good. Oh, he aims his hand like it's a gun. I'm River, so check your records. One more time. Mercy. Say it again. Mercy. One more time. Mercy. But he was dead. Who told he did. You that? He did. Rule one. The doctor lies. The doctor lies. The doctor lies. The it died. It died. <laughs> <laughs> Hmm. Where'd everything go? History's being erased. Time's running out. Doctor, what were you doing? Tell us. Doctor. Big Bang. The Big Bang. That's the beginning of the universe, right? If you threw the Pandorica. Hmm. That's what I thought. That's where you get the infinite fire. thing. Then what? Then let there be light. The light from the Pandorica would explode everywhere at once. Oh, just like he said. And, and that would work? That would bring everything back? A restoration field powered by an exploding TARDIS happening at every moment in history. Oh, that's brilliant. Mm -hmm. He's going to fly the Pandorica into the heart of the explosion. Yeah, it's the most important thing left in the universe. While I'm doing this, Emma, your house was too big. That big, empty house, just you. Oh, no, Sharon. Where were your mum and dad? Where was everybody who lived in that big house? It's okay, it's okay, don't panic. It's not your fault. Is it because it they were erased when they... <laughs> it's okay, he's not going to be dead either. Not really. So crazy. <laughs> Here it all goes. Oh. <laughs> okay. I escaped then. Brilliant. <laughs> Love it when I do that. <laughs> Legs, yes. But I cool. This is stressing me out. Behave. Do not let that girl open her eyes. Amy, later. River gonna need your computer. <sighs> do you remember this moment? Amy. Yeah. You need to stop trusting me. This is when I started liking him as the doctor. You don't always tell me the truth. If I always told you the truth, I wouldn't need you to trust me. Doctor, the crack in my wall. How can it be here? I don't know yet, but I'm working it out. <laughs> no. You have to remember it. That's not the point. 
you have to remember. Remember what? Doctor? It's a big moment that wasn't quite caught. That is the moment where I started liking him as the doctor. That's so interesting. When you wake up, you'll have a mum and dad. <laughs> and you won't even remember me. Well, you remember me a little. So I'll be a story in your head. So that's okay. It's not all a story in the end. <laughs> Must be terrible to just make it a good one, eh? Because you care about people who constantly seem to be forgetting you. He's talking about the TARDIS. You'll dream about that box. He'll never leave you. Big and little at the same time. Brand new and ancient and the bluest blue ever. ever. <laughs> Would have had. Never had. In your, dream, in your dreams, I'll still be there. <laughs> the Doctor and Amy Pond. So feel free to tip it out of the window. <laughs> Downstairs, ten minutes, big day. Uh, my tiny no. <laughs> Amelia, why are you behaving as if you've never seen us before? I don't know. It's just. Hello. Do you feel like you've forgotten something really important? Do you feel like there's a great big thing in your head, and you feel like you should remember it, but you can't? Cut. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Are you just saying yes because you're scared? <laughs> yeah. Are you saying yes because you're scared of uh, yeah. me? Uh, I mean, I love you too. <laughs> you thought she wouldn't get married. I thought she would not end up married. <laughs> Amy, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Right. Uh, Ugh, fine. She's always crying without realizing it. Why am I doing that? Is it real? Is it not real? Or it's just little things that are reminding her of him? If she can remember him, he can come back and be ex and exist again. That's what's happening. And all the little things are helping her remember. And she's going to bring him back into existence. Because she's got the universe in her brain. I figured the show out. <laughs> okay, Doctor. I surprise you this time. Gotcha. Uh, yeah. Completely. <laughs> Never expected that. From now on, I shall be leaving the kissing duties to the brand new Mr. <laughs> Pond. No, I'm not Mr. Pond. That's not how it yeah. works. Here it is. <laughs> yeah, it is. Yeah, it is. I'm in my box. Where'd my cat go? Oh, I, I see her. Space. I only came for the dancing. <laughs> That's it. That's he dances a lot like me. Go <laughs> 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 did, did you dance? Well, you always dance at weddings, don't you? Who are you? You're going to find out very soon, man. And I'm sorry. But that's when everything changes. That's when everything changes. Hi! Hey, you off to? We haven't even had a snog in the shrubbery. Yet. 
Amy! Shut up! It's my wedding! Shut up! It's oh, my wedding! Sorry, you two. Shouldn't have slipped away. It's a bit busy, you know? They lean out. Bye, everyone! <laughs> Rory is actually back! Rory's actually back. I didn't think it would happen. Good job, everyone, not revealing that to me. People were like, yeah, Rory's death. Rest in peace, Rory. Y'all got me. Y'all got me good. Gotcha. Gotcha. Rory's back. They got married. Yeah, they did get married. Well, I knew like halfway through the season that if he'd lived, that things were going to work out. She she loves him. Um, okay. Stephen Moffat, you get a pass this time. <laughs> I fear sometimes that he is making things convoluted and dramatic for the sake of being convoluted and dramatic. And so that is why I occasionally feel wary. And yeah. he makes me feel a little like I need to put up a, an emotional barrier because I feel him just – he'll just toy with my emotions at any time. This is how I feel about him as the showrunner. The, um, yeah. But uh, I really enjoyed that episode. It was exciting, intense, and confusing, and weird, and emotional, and beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Rory waiting, guarding her for 2,000 2, years. Thousand I can't years. think of anything more romantic, freaking romantic than that. Like, that is – stupid it's so good and uh, and the monologue the doctor gives Ugh. amelia uh she's sleeping before he says goodbye is just so beautiful and so well acted we're all just stories in the end <sighs> might as well make it a good one there's a lot, of, a lot of good stuff and i guess and I wasn't sure, like, are we losing them as companions? Is that what this is? But I know. we're not. So I'm excited about that. I'm excited. I love Rory. I love He's him. such, he's so good. I love him. I love so him. I'm, I'm just really excited. So much. He's he one of my favorite. He might be my favorite companion. companion. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I love he's one Donna, of my favorites. But man, Rory is great. And that moment where. <laughs> The doctor, as he does, is kind of like testing him and like pushing the limit and is like, when he you know, your girlfriend's him. not more important than the rest of the universe. And he's just like, she is to me. What's great about Rory is some of the same things that were great about Donna, which is they will call the doctor out. Rory has yeah. always done it. He's yeah. like, hey, you make people want to put themselves in danger for you. You do this. You do this. I don't like what you're doing. I'm going to punch you in the face. Like he's not afraid to like. Stand up for what yeah. he believes and what he loves. And the doctor freaking needs that. Oh, yeah. Oh, gosh. Ugh. Ugh, he's... And River's <sighs> got to become, I think, more of a thing, it seems. And um, I still think she kills him, for sure. Okay. It's got to be um, so hard. I would think before every scene she's in, she needs to go to, you know, the writers and be like, okay, now... Well, who am I right now? Like, where am I? What's just where happened? What am I, I coming in from? The timeline? Yeah, what, <laughs> like, what, what's in my journal? What page am I on? You know, like, that's a lot to have to keep up with as an actor. Yeah. Yeah. It's, I'm excited. I'm excited for you to learn more about her. I'm excited for more Amy and Rory. Yeah. I love that Thank moment you. of like, yep, time to say bye. I knew bye. it. I was like, they're saying goodbye to the people out there. They're not saying goodbye to the doctor. Come on. Hell nah. No way. They're not ready for that. Just because you get married doesn't mean the adventure's over. Exactly. Especially for Amy and Rory. Are you kidding me? Yeah, they're just getting started. So much to come. I, know. I can't believe we did it. We watched a whole season in quarantine. A whole season in quarantine. And I, yeah, and I, I mean, I'm officially adjusted to Matt Smith. Um, oh, yeah. I mean, I have been. And like I said, it was that moment. It's really cool that that moment that won me over to him. And I think if we were to go back to our you episode would of it that, this time. I've said, I think even in that moment, I was like, okay, I think I like him because of this thing. Maybe yeah. even during that moment, I might have expressed it. And it's cool that that was a moment that was him later coming back. Um, it's interesting. So, yeah, it's yeah. it's definitely 
Moffat's definitely got that that long haul. Like mm-hmm. he's he's very much about that big arc. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah. yeah, he's you know I had we're very similar when we watch these these types of things. We've talked about that before. Mm-hmm. Um, I was just as weary when I first watched this. Very. But it's Moffat. also like okay if like there's one thing with a show that lasts for 60 years or whatever you know it's like like every moment yeah some of it is going to be good and some of it isn't or and good isn't even the right word some of it is going to be to your personal taste and some of it isn't and some of it isn't and especially a show with so many writers especially with a show that changes writer you know Mm -hmm. it's it's a lot yeah it doesn't mean that we don't enjoy it i mean this uh like I said, the the day that you go back and rewatch it, it's going to be so much fun. Yeah. Um, I'll catch things. I'll be like, whoa. I'm glad it didn't turn out that she was, I was so nervous. It was going to be like, why is your house so empty? Why does your life not make sense? It's because you ain't real. You're not real. I was like, don't be. But now I'm like, okay, it's because things were getting sucked into that. How, how sad is that? <laughs> Thanks, y'all, for being on a, one more step of the journey with us. Uh, you know? As your Gallifrey gals have gotten all wibbly wobbly, and this really was wibbly wobbly. Very wibbly wobbly, this go around. <laughs> uh, I guess uh, catch us next time as we watch more Who? Who? The Doctor. <laughs> and the Pawns! And the Pawns! Mr. Pond, that's Mr. not Pond. how it works. Yes, yes it, it is. is. <laughs> <laughs> Bye, everyone. Hey guys, thanks so much for watching. If you liked this video, go ahead and give it a little thumbs up. And if you want to be notified when we post new content, go ahead and subscribe to our channel and hit that little bell in the corner.